CBS Broadcast Center in Los Angeles. This is CBS 2 News at 6 p.m. New tonight, only on CBS 2 News at 6, the South Bay's Jewish community is fed up after a series of anti-Semitic hate incidents at Manhattan Beach schools. Good evening, everyone. I'm Pat Harvey. This is the ninth anti-Semitic hate incident to happen this year at Manhattan Beach schools. And tonight, the community is demanding action by the district. CBS 2's Arena Nakano spoke to a local rabbi who says enough is enough. Hate symbols etched on a bathroom stall at Miracosta High School in Manhattan Beach. The incident from early February was just the start. Four days later, another. The next week, yet another at Robinson Elementary. The community's had enough of sweeping it under the rug and really wants concrete steps to be taken. Senior Rabbi Joshua Kalev says just this year there have been nine reported incidents of anti-Semitism at Manhattan Beach Union Schools. The most recent incident happened here at Penny Camp Elementary. On Saturday, staff found hateful language left on the walls. It's almost like their innocence is being taken away, right? These are not conversations we want to be having with young elementary school students yet. Rabbi Kalev says many students in his congregation no longer feel safe at school. My teens have said to me as of late that they don't feel comfortable wearing a Jewish star to school. At the last school board meeting on September 14th, dozens of people demanded the school district take immediate action to stop the hate. I am beyond disturbed because I still have siblings, family members, and younger friends who go to school here. Passive behavior of nice people is the beginning of a war. Superintendent John Bowes addressing the public. Anti-Semitism and hate acts of any kind have no place in our community or on our campuses. In a statement, the district said in the last year it sent staff to the Museum of Tolerance, implemented diversity and inclusion programs, and added dozens of books about the Holocaust in their schools. At the meeting, the board members approved a nearly $400,000 upgrade to the school's security camera systems. Rabbi Kalev says that's a good first step. It's more than just graffiti. Um, we have to take this threat seriously because the last time we didn't, six million of our people were killed. In Manhattan Beach, I'm Rena Nakano, CBS 2 News.